Hello guys, welcome to the Dude Danger Bros channel, and today I'm doing another episode of the Maze Run 2. And uh, let's get straight into it. So, we remember in the last episode, Spider Man, he was still on the hunt for Uncle Ben's killer, but he, at least he found out some more clues to um, Uncle Ben's killer. And now we're just, we're just moving on on that. So, yeah. Let's continue. Oh yeah, I don't, I don't like about this game that it takes it takes a long time to load. Well, it's probably not the only thing I don't like about this game. There's probably some more things that you guys haven't seen yet that I don't like about this game. But yeah, this game here is already taking all day to load. Like I play some old games and they take they they take faster. I mean, they go uh, faster. Um, and also, sometimes they have more data than them. Like, I barely even have any data in this game. So, yeah. Come on, game. Hurry up and load it. Alright, there we go. This right here is where we um, left off. Did I say, wait, net up there? That was so cool. <clears throat> so we go swinging again in the bright sky. It's a comic stand. I get a comic stand. Because Stan Lee's in there. Because if you look at the words up there, the D is red. So let's go inside. Who was that? A girl, girl. I can't, I can't really tell, but it looked more, more like a girl. I'm telling you, this game here takes a long time to load. Not, and I'm not really a big fan of that. There's Stan Lee, the person that we, sta that, that we saved last time in that fire. You know, I, I didn't really like, like what he did with Stan Lee in this game because he's just like. A businessman, an all-time businessman, which is wasn't really a good thing to do with Stanley to me because he's not he's not that even though I'm in the Spider-Man, he didn't know about Peter Parker, but that was after Uncle Ben died. So I don't know how I know about Uncle Ben, but Peter Parker probably told him to, told him that. So yeah. You unlock figures, various figures, and uh, adventure and learn cool facts by taking a look at them. By collecting comic pages in the city, you will unlock cool comic books to to be read, to be read. Oh, to be read. Take a peek at awesome concept art from the game's production. Practice your fighting skills with the coin up, coin op, or just a machine. <clears throat> right now we just need to exit the comic stand. Cause I'm not about to do any of that stuff right now. Sorry guys. Please not take a long time to load game. Someone actually has some faith in you. Come on. See? Here we go again. Al? Nope. Maybe. <clears throat> there we go. Alright. Sorry, it was, one of the, it was one of my favorite parts. If 
but I'm going to have to wait hours. Yep, there's Carradine. We have somewhere at two hours, right, Pete? Right, Pete. Yeah, I'm in that part, so that's how I know. Anyways, got a character upgrade. Scroll me down. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not doing this right now. Just show me this. Wait, no, can we press it? Let me press 500, so yeah, we can go ahead and get it. Here's that slingshot detail. Alright, let's go. And I'm not really a big fan of Spider Man Sweet Games again either. I mean, it's cool and all, but it's, it's on the old Spider Man games, like Spider Man 3, it's probably one of the best games. Best Spider Man games ever made. Because I, I, cause me and my brother used to play that all the time. I like how I had that part with the thing that guy was talking. I forgot what it was called. Because it was like the city part. You know? I, I, like, I like the city part. So you need to go out the city to do stuff. Alright, scroll up. Not scroll up. Run up. I like the, the running thing though. Sometimes it just makes Spider-Man look really, really messy. Like in this game, it makes Spider-Man look, look like he's he's like just flying all over the place and sloppy. Well, in the movies, he wasn't doing all that. So he just hit, he just hit that thing. That's my fault though. Sorry. Okay. You know, Spider Man, that is very dumb. Why aren't you hiding behind a trash can? You're literally like, like on the side of that trash can. Can you guys see that? Like, you, you can see his shoulder and his half of the spider and his leg. And Carradine says, What's that? That's so dumb. How can you not tell what that is? What the freak? Get on the car. What are you doing? I did what you call a true glitch. Hi, Spidey. Do your thing. That was cool. You know, I saw, I saw that before. But, say. Can you know, shot, shot him like five times? Like, I was trying to shoot him, and I was like, it went right, right on him. Come on, Spidey, call 911. Call the police to help you or something, because so far you're doing terrible. All right, I got I, I got this this time. That's that. Uh, just keep pressing square. You get this guy out of the car first. There we go. Bye bye. Now open up the glass one. And there she is. Let's, let's, let's get her out. Let's, let's get her out this time. All right. Touch the car. Be safe. Ah, oh, Spidey. You should have got ran over. I mean, Carradine should, should, should at least should try to get him off the car. I'm just driving the whole time. How, how's that going to work? Okay. Okay. There's Carradine with the star. Wow, you didn't see that? Come on, Spidey. It should have it been the first thing you saw instead of that carnage kill again. I mean, I, I would have thought the CK was just around thing, but then I look look closely, it would be a blood, so then I'll, I'll realize it realize it later. But, come on, Spidey. I think Spider Man still has super eyesight. That's what I think. You guys may not think that, but I think it. And I always think it. Until. One one of the people from Marvel tell me, "Hey, that's not super eyesight." Should be pretty sad because 
that he has super eyesight. Let's play this. I get it, Doc. I know how this is supposed to go. I tell you my I tell you my parents beat me or dropped me on my head. I had a, a horrible childhood. Boo hoo. And sure, it had his memories. My dad beat me unconscious. It's crazy. My mom drank. Yeah, you know, you don't you drink to get drunk. But a lot of people go through that and don't end up like I did. Here's what really happened. When I was just a kid, I saw the truth. Life is meaningless. All right. And the only thing that matters is death. I, I remember that, guys. Yeah, that's right. I remember, that. I, I remember reading it like two times. You know, this is very, 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 very sad. Very, very. And Carradine, yeah, he's crazy. Now we know why he's crazy. Just, just like Deadpool, was, both of his parents died. Just like the Joker. Yeah, they, they basically have all the same stories, but the story I think, think is the best is probably the Jokers. And Heath Ledger, I think that played him. Yeah, I believe it's Heath Ledger. I don't know, I was going to mix up these um, actors. But if you guys look closely, I think I just grown on looks a lot like the Carnage face or Venom. I think in the Miss Carnage 3, they're probably going to have a Venom. I, I just probably Easter egg inside the game. They probably had. They're probably going to have. But now we know they're not coming out with another main Spider-Man, so it's probably not going to be on Venom. But I think it's a good thing to do. Because of the Spider-Mans. Of the main Spider-Man. But the main Spider-Man 1 was actually pretty good. And then they came out with main Spider-Man 2. And I'm like, what is this? Then you guys watch the Austin Spider-Man vs. Sinister 6. Aunt May knows his Spider-Man, which does not make sense at all. I don't, I, I don't like that. But yeah. I was going to load again. Isn't it the first time we got in this house? No. I think it is the first time we ever got in this house. Man, if you go back to the main Spider-Man, this is so weird playing again. I did that before. And guess what? I didn't play after that. You know, this is very crazy talking, about yourself, talking to yourself. You know, Spider-Man... How about these other guys? He's talking to himself right now. Spider, spider suits. I'm just gonna look through them, but I'm probably not gonna pick any. There's some missions. I don't remember playing any. I don't remember playing any missions on this PS3 pro profile. That's right. That's right. It's the PS3. Gwen made me this costume. Sometimes I imagine all the comics. Wow, that's. I'm skipping through all these. Ah, uh, memories. The first costume. Guess I could put it on again. Four times. So, the first was Spider costume. Oh, look at the bottom. It says Eel. Because he was. Remember how he was going through that? The lizard stuff? And everybody's getting all sick. You know, if you wore, if you, if you wore that again, you probably get a whole bunch of other people sick. That suit is just disgusting me. Nasty right now. Because of what Spider Man did with it. Okay, Spider Man. Wow. Wrong side. Here is our main watching TV. She's so lonely. Alright. Anyways, let's turn up this TV. Yeah, let's turn up the carry thing. Let's get. Wow, bruh. He's right here's the Daily Beagle, by the way. Lie, this ain't a lie. You know when this game came out? You know when this game came out? I'm a freaking 2014. I'm just not playing this game, which is sad. I should have I played this game earlier. So sorry, guys, but I, I, I just had to play it a couple times and then let y'all see it. I'm trying to see if it's, uh, if it's, in a, if it's inappropriate. It's inappropriate. I know a, a lot of you can handle it, but yeah. If you guys remember Whitney, Whitney, Whitney Chain from May, the Maze Spider game, which I do have that. But I'm probably not, not going to do a series about that. If you guys remember the game, 
um, the main Spider Man, she, she was in there and, you know, Spy uh, Peter Parker and her had a little thing. I think they try to copy that Spider Man animated series. Not copy it, but like, do like what they're doing. I'm not, I'm not saying copy because this right here is basically the same story. I don't know what to say. I'm going to put a circle because I don't like any of those words. You know, she's like saying that it's a good thing that Cars could be killed. Oh, yeah. And she's actually saying that it's a bad thing. It just don't make any sense because I remember when I played this game, she was saying that it was a good thing that he was out there killing people, these bad guys. This last corpse. Still looks good ass new. No, it doesn't. You know, I loved Oscorp, especially from the Amazing Spider Man. I hated Oscorp. I really hated it. I remember in the very first part that Green almost got affected, and Spider Man almost got affected. That the counters definitely got affected. And, that, and Mr. Smythe got, got on my last nerves. Spider Man almost died in that game. I really hate Oscorp because he did all that. Alright, guys, thank you for watching, and hope you have a great day. This is right if, if you do enjoy the channel.